Hello. Thank you for tuning in. I'm Giovanni Vett, and I'm here to share my story with you. I have been living for the past eight years in chronic laboring pains. I have been living since 2015, excuse me, I've been living in pain since actually 2014 when I was pregnant with my third child. I have, and I delivered her in February 2015. Since 2014, I have been living in chronic, chronic pain, which come to find out, I've been living in labor. I've actually been living in labor without being pregnant. So basically, my body never turned off from when I was pregnant. I know, right? Let me say it again. My body never turned off from when I was pregnant. I have been living in labor for eight years. Eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight years labor. I'm here to share my story with you today. I've been a prisoner of my own body, eight years in chronic labor. It all started back on May 2014 when I found out that I was six weeks and five days pregnant when I had to do a trip to the ER. Fast forward, June 14th, I moved to Atlanta. This is gonna be just a timeline. I'll dissect everything and I'll break up my story um, in videos to come. So June 14th, I moved to Atlanta. July 14th, I found out that I was five weeks and six days pregnant with a rainbow baby. October 14th, I went on bed rest full time living in Atlanta. February 2015, I delivered my third child named Destiny. March 2015, I moved back to Delaware. Fast forward, after two years of pain, I realized I had chronic pain without answers. December 2017, I got my tubes tied. That's when the pain went into my back. November 2019, I got into Dr. Patel's care for stimulator, which is called a dorsal root ganglion. March 2020, I had my first stimulator, the dorsal root ganglion, installed. November the 20th, 2020, I had my second stimulator, which is the spinal cord stimulator, installed. Come November the 20th, 2022, I mean, excuse me, come November 20th, 2020, I now have two stimulators installed in my body to help me with my chronic pain that I was suffering from. December the 4th, 2020, my two weeks of amazing relief died. Fast forward, July 13th, 2021. Third back surgery for, July 13th, 2021 was my third back surgery to repair my first stimulator, which is my DRG, due to a malfunctioning and we had to go in and physically manually do it, which is another surgery. So that was my third back surgery come July 13th. September 2021 was my first visit from my grandmother who had transitioned on and she informed me in a dream that I was going to the wrong doctors and she informed me in a dream that I was getting the wrong care. September 20, September 2021, I went to the OBGYN. October 2021, I had testing and biopsy done on my breast and my uterus. December 2021, I had my breast removed, excuse me, I had my lump from my breast removed, and I had two iron infusions also in the month of December 2021. December 17th, 2021, I had my first round of a Lupron shot. January through March of 2022, I started to thrive. March 2022, I met with the OBGYN to move forward 
with the hysterectomy surgery. March 3rd, 2022, I came out of chronic depression. March 2022, I entertained my second Lupron shot. My 90 days is over with to keep everything calm until the surgery. We did two rounds of Lupron. June 9th, 2022, I had a total hysterectomy. Everything was removed. Cervix, uterus, fallopian tubes, ovaries. The day of my surgery, I had two and a half weeks of pain medication left over, which let me know I was living again. June 9th, 2022 to August 18th, 2022, 10 weeks of physical healing that I had to endure after my surgery. September the 7th, 2022, one of my spiritual guides came to me and helped me with all the facts that I had to put it together to see the big picture, to understand that what I was suffering from, all that I was dealing with, all the pain and the trauma that I was experiencing was that of something that has never been articulated. And I will break it down to help many, 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 many women out there. But basically, I've been walking around in labor and I was not pregnant any longer. September the 8th through, September the 8th, 2022, to September the 8th, 2022 to October the 11th, 2022, I have been celebrating, healing, and reflecting back on my last eight years. And now I'm here to share my story with you. If you know anyone who is suffering from any type of pain while they're pregnant, any type of pain after they have delivered their child, any type of vaginal pain that had to do with a miscarriage of a baby, anything in that type of realm, anyone who um, may have experienced depression, these are the people that I'm needing to speak with these are the these are the individuals these are the females and the men that i need to speak with when it comes to understanding what i just overcame for the last eight years and how literally i've been walking around in labor without being pregnant that's how amazing the body is the body is so amazing that i have literally been walking around for eight years a big huge medical mystery no doctor have been able to answer. No doctor have been able to articulate to me why I have been plagued with that kind of chronic pain that stole my mental, that stole my identity. No one, no doctor, no specialist, all the care I received, all the surgeries I received, until it all came to head when the spiritual realm visited me and let me know what all my facts were, and they put all the facts together and gave me the big picture to understand that I had been walking around in labor without being pregnant. So, during this video, <clears throat> this is just a timeline, but I'm just here to share with you that this does exist. I know I'm not the only woman. I, I know that I'm going to be able to help women. I know that even if this video or these videos help just one person, just help one person understand where they are in their journey of life and what they're being plagued with at the time, then I've done my job. I've done my job with sharing. I've done my job with helping with articulating what's plaguing us. Um, that's a big medical mystery. You know, how how is it? that this woman is before me telling me that she's been walking around in labor and she hasn't been pregnant. Well, stay tuned. Subscribe, follow, do whatever you need to do. But just listen for my story. I have eight years of information to unload. Eight years. When you come watching my videos, please come prepared. Please come with a pen and paper. Please come to take notes because I'm coming to have class. I'm coming to inform you of what you're going through. I'm coming to inform you, the women that are out there suffering during their pregnancies, I'm coming to help you out. I'm coming to let you know what it is exactly that's not being articulated to you during your time of need on why you're in all this pain. So again, I'm Jovine and I'm here. I'm nervous. 
I'm very nervous. I'm very nervous to be in front of you sharing my story. Several reasons. Number one, this is all still new to me. All this information. I'm just, I've had about a month to process it all. Okay, that's, that's, that's number one. Number two, I'm being vulnerable and I'm putting myself out in front of everybody to where I'm sharing something that's not the norm. It's not in the media. It's, it's, it's not something that's being talked about, you know, and you may even think that this is a crazy woman that's in front of me talking about she's been pregnant for, excuse me, that she's been walking around in labor uh, for, for eight years and she hasn't been pregnant. Oh, but what I'm sharing with you is actual facts. What I'm sharing with you is my truth. What I'm sharing with you is a thing. What I'm sharing with you is something that's not understood. And I'm here to break it down for you. I'm here to help out the medical community. I'm here to help out the black community. I'm here to help out the sisterhood. I'm here to help you understand why your body is going through what it's going through when it's pregnant. And if it's still plaguing you after you've delivered, so now you understand why and what you may be dealing with. So again, I'm Giovanni Beck. Stay tuned, subscribe. And take this healing journey with me. Part of my journey in healing is sharing my story. And I'm ready to share it. So, until the next video, please be patient with me. Please be kind to me. Please be supportive with me. And please share. Even if it's crazy to you. You sharing on your social media platform, you have no idea who you can help. You may be friends with somebody who knows someone, who knows someone that is going through this. I may be coming forward publicly sharing my story, but privately in my circle and in my community, I've already helped many women with their journey and understanding what they were dealing with while they were pregnant. I've been able to help pregnant women go to the doctors and give this information to the doctors and walk away with proper care now because I have been suffering enough for all of us. I literally have been suffering enough for all of us. None of us need to suffer like this anymore. And I'm here to crack this thing wide open. So stay tuned. Like, subscribe, share, do all that other kind of stuff. Um, again, like I said, this is not for entertainment purposes. This is truly for healing. This is truly for understanding. This is truly informational. This is truly something that I need your help with getting out there. I need your help with spreading the word. I need your help with understanding that if you have a woman, a sister, a cousin, a female that has been pregnant and has had this debilitating pelvic pain, have had this pain ever since they were pregnant. If they have been diagnosed with something called synthesis pubic dysfunction, if they have not been diagnosed with something called synthesis pubic dysfunction, if they have been diagnosed with depression, why they have been pregnant, why they have been living with this pain and they can't understand why this baby hurts so bad. They are the ones that I need to talk to. They are the ones that I need to hear my story. And I need your help doing so. So please, family, please share the video. Help me out. Help out these sisters that's out here that are struggling. Not near one of us need to struggle another eight years with something that's so simple that can be articulated. And I found out how, exactly how, to be able to help out the sisterhood. I've been able to articulate into words something the doctors have not been able to do for me. So much so that when I visited my doctors and I broke this thing wide open, my doctor couldn't do nothing but lean against the wall and stare into space because he could not believe that I have truly articulated everything that I've been through. And he's been part of my journey. And to understand that all that I've been plagued with was exactly that. Living in chronic labor and pains. So again, I'm Giovanni Vett. Please like, subscribe, share, all that other good stuff. And until the next video, peace family. I love you. 
and enjoy your day.